Don't know why I'm drifting, I'm drifting so Out of my mind Hello Taurus, this is you versus them for the week of the 19th through the 26th. This is for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. If you guys are new, as always, welcome. If you like the video, please hit the like button, share the video, subscribe. <coughs> Let's see. And to my subscribers, thank you guys, as always, um, for coming and supporting me. Let's see what's going on with you guys in the past. What's going on with Taurus in the past? The King of Swords. Aries had the Queen of Swords. Um, hmm. I feel like with you guys, there were some misunderstandings. Um, I don't feel like in the past you were that comfortable with just showing your emotions fully. And, um, you know, sometimes I can come across as being cold and non-feeling, but I don't think that's the case at all. Uh, that's Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy there. But um, I think you definitely are no nonsense. You've been no nonsense. Okay. Let's see. What was going on in the recent past with the other person? Four of Pentacles feeling very closed off I feel um, this person probably did not have an abundance of money or um, maybe their job was not as um, lucrative as as yours was but I feel like this person um, was almost like a penny pincher they probably didn't hold on to money that well they probably spent you know more often than they should have okay Capricorn energy there <clears throat> let's see what's currently going on for my Tauruses six of Pentacles okay so I'm glad I looked at it but um, you want somebody to meet you halfway in every um, area of a relationship whether it's financially whether it's emotionally um, you want somebody to basically just be a partner for you mentally challenging um, you know all of that you guys may currently be in a situation with someone um, that you're feeling like you're not really getting what you um, what you need okay maybe another Taurus individual or um, or an Aries Capricorn I'm looking at this card and I'm realizing that's not the six of Pentacles that's the three of Pentacles trying to work things out compromise um, some of you may have started a new job or went into business with someone here what's currently going on for the other person what's currently going on for the other person the will of fortune hmm. a lot of changes are going on right now um, they may be involved in a karmic situation that they feel like is um, beneficial for them. Also, being that in the past, they were in maybe a financial upheaval. I feel like, you know, something is going their way right now by way of finances. Um, this person also may be having a change of heart when it comes to you guys and wanting to compromise and work with you and realizing that you know you can't be Taurus cannot be in a relationship by themselves they can't flip the bill for everything that there has to be a compromise and even keel here okay equal give and take 
So um, definitely some changes that are going on for both of you. I feel major changes. Let's see. What's influencing Taurus currently? What's influencing Taurus? Seven of Cups. Right now you're confused about how you feel. Mm hmm because I see that you do have options um, again some of you guys may already be involved with someone that you're trying to um, build something with but maybe this person you know you're sensing a change in them you may see a change in them and it's kind of um, you know stirring up some old feelings for you and you're really not sure um, whether it's a good idea to walk away from what you have going on right now to even you know allow this to you know tempt you so um, and I feel like you guys definitely do have options you have options um, very solid options I feel okay I feel like right now you're currently if, if you are involved with someone this is somebody who um, and meets you at least on a financial level at least by you know putting in a time and effort into a situation I don't know if this person fulfills it for you emotionally though I feel like you know that is um, a concern for some of you <clears throat> what's influencing the other person what's influencing the other person two of wands what to do what to do could be an Aries here Sagittarius Pisces what to do it's like they, they have this level of confusion too um, but I feel like this person knows more so what it is that they want to do is that they're kind of sitting on their hands with it at this point okay not actually doing what it is that they feel that they want to they may be waiting for you guys to make the first move <clears throat> let's see what's coming in for Taurus what's coming in for Taurus it's coming in for Taurus. Scorpio energy here as well, if I didn't say that already. It's coming in for Taurus. The High Priestess. Following your heart. Following your heart. Um, I feel like your heart is with this person. But you guys haven't spoken. And you're really not sharing that information either. You're keeping it to yourself. You're keeping it to yourself. I feel like definitely your heart is with this um, other individual. And it's probably why you guys are here. Let's see. <clears throat> What's coming in for the other person? Then we have the fool in reverse. They're waiting on you. They're waiting on you. Um, but they're a little hesitant about definitely Aries energy here they're hesitant about making the first move they're really not sure if it could work out with you guys um, whether they should attempt to come your way again um, I don't see them taking a leap of faith towards you um, because maybe they feel like you don't really care because you're coming across as you don't and um so yeah let's see what is the outcome for taurus this person's having a hard time because this person cares about you too mm -hmm. um maybe you guys a lot of cars are flipping over here hang on one second maybe you guys um definitely haven't talked in a while um they don't know where your head is you don't know where their head is and um there's a lot that you guys don't know in regard to the other one situation we have the nine of pentacles we have the eight of pentacles um and the four of cups so it's like this situation is such that both of you i feel are single at least that's the way you feel even if you guys are currently um involved with someone you're not truly 
invested in that situation I feel um, the other person is single as well and I feel thinking about you know rebuilding a connection with you they're thinking about it but being very complacent um, emotionally and feeling stable and really not wanting to rock the boat not trying to step out of the comfort zone I feel like both of you are at that point where you're just really not trying to uh, step out of your comfort zone and rock your stability <clears throat> oh, wow okay what is the outcome for Taurus cars I want to jump out here okay outcome for Taurus King of Pentacles getting your money getting your money there's a strong male figure I feel that um, is present a Taurus strong male I think this male is um, more comfortable more comfortable not expressing their emotion they show their the, their care and concern by taking care of the person that they're with and it comes across cold and aloof so for you that male um, I think it's intimidating for the other person okay very intimidating and if you feel like you want this person or you're waiting on this person I don't see that person being comfortable enough to come towards you okay so there something is gonna have to give for them to open up to you I don't feel like they're closed off to you I just don't feel them making that that first move towards you for that meal for <clears throat> for others of you you guys are focused mainly right now on your mundane life securing your livelihood okay um, and that's where you find comfort I feel so I don't really see you making a move um, I see a lot of you guys wanting to um, but I feel like you're so very strong and kind of setting your ways I feel like this is an older individual a lot of you are older um, more mature and what I mean by older is like not in your um, early 20s you know somebody that's very stable grounded you know has their head on and knows what they want out of life um, some of you will commit to this person because it's convenient the one that you really don't have like that strong emotional connection with but you have you know everything else with end up committing to this person <clears throat> because this was safe what's coming in for the other person what's coming in for the other person seven of wands mm -hmm. <clears throat> I think this person is um, they're very guarded I think that right now they're even though they care for you this person may be blocking you energetically okay um, they have a lot of movement going on currently they're really stepping out on faith in other areas of their life um, I feel like their financial life is improving for sure but um, they definitely have established boundaries that will remain in place if they feel like um, they didn't have any with you guys. So that is what I have for you guys. We have um, Leo energy is here. Aries is definitely here. Sagittarius, Pisces, Capricorn energy. Could be a Scorpio <clears throat> or could be a Taurus like yourself. Uh, I've been blind too long, now I finally see the real and fake, who's down for me? Yeah. Yeah. The situation wasting my time. I had enough, I'm tired of the lies. Blah, 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 da, 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 da. What are you saying?